How's the catch on this one, Mark? Good fish. Yeah. Yeah, sorry, I figured you'd rather have the wind though. Pulling, pulling your leg, Joe. Just a little bit. Sorry. Yeah. Man. Look at that bass. That's nice. Yeah, look at the walleye. There's at least one. I, I, I'm disappointed already though because I thought this would have more walleye in there. Got one good one. Uh, fish, fish survey, netting survey out on Lake Cadillac. I'm uh, just collecting data, collecting. Uh, scales and spines off these fish so that we can age them later. Then we can uh, take that age data and compare it with, um, you know, with what we've seen in the past on, uh, on Lake Cadillac and then also compare it with uh, other lakes around the state and see how well the, the fish are growing compared to those lakes. Uh, walleye 17.3. So, so far today we've seen um, really good numbers of crappie, uh, and largemouth bass and smallmouth bass. A lot of nice legal bass. Um, we've seen uh, a fair number of walleye. I think we're up to eight so far in our nets with uh, several nets yet to come, so that's not bad. The walleye have ranged from uh, 15 inches up to 24 inches. The biggest bass we've seen have been up to uh, uh, 19 inches. Their walleye 16.1. It will be interesting to see these these wall these smaller walleye that have been 15, 16 inches in Lake Cadillac. I suspect are from the 2008 year class where when we stocked last. Uh, so um, and that you know collecting these spines and those scales will tell us you know what year class they're from. Cadillac. Hopefully it's the only one we'll find. Hopefully they're not established here. Uh, carp are common carp are an exotic species, and we would not want them in uh, in in lakes Cadillac and Mitchell. Um, there's no gear, you know. I have no no way of knowing exactly how it got here, but um, one common way of spreading fish like that would be through uh, bait buckets. So. If you are uh, if you're fishing and you and you buy minnows, make sure you, that you're not dumping your leftover minnows in the lake. You know for that reason, um, it's it's possible that you know that that carp was little in a load of minnows and just got mixed in there and you know was mistakenly then dumped into the lake. So when you're done fishing uh, with you know with minnows, you know dump them on shore. Don't dump them in uh, in in the lake.